The Los Al Equine Sale of 2017 is brought to you by the Stallions of Burns Ranch in Menifee, California. StallionEasters.com previews the upcoming Pacific Coast Quarter Horse Racing Association Breeders' Derby as part of the coverage of the Los Al Equine Sale of 2017 brought to you by the Stallions at Burns Ranch. On this episode, we go to the barn of trainer Jose Flores at Los Alamitas to talk to him about his second fastest qualifier going into the Pacific Coast Quarter Horse Racing Association Derby, Miss Jess Knockout. And then his third fastest qualifier going into the Pacific Coast Quarter Horse Futurity, A Political Stone. And then we have a brief discussion with him about how the older horse division is shaping up as we move closer to the Champion of Champions. Jose, talk to me about the second fastest qualifier going into the Pacific Coast Quarter Horse Breeders Derby. You know what, Miss Just Knockout, she's been a good horse to us. You know, um, she qualified at two million last year. You know, she came back in the first start a little bit sluggish. She needed really the out. She get back in form and really, really explodes from the gate. And if she can leave that way, you know, she really has a shot at it. Uh, talk to me about the third fastest qualifier you got going into the Futurity. Well, he's a, he's always a hard knocking gelding. He's always done well, and um, every time we put him in something he qualifies, he's just got a little bit of luck in the challenge. Um, but now he's made it a good, a good race in this, so hopefully if he can be healthy all the way down to the race, he might have a good shot against um, Kiwi Corona and the Revelant, which is real nice horses. And I think um, he can really perform up to what he can. He might cause him a little bit of trouble, so we're hoping that um, everything goes well for him, has a clean trip, and... Like I say, healthy all the way to the race, and maybe things will be a little bit, he might have a shot of a better performance than he did um, in past finals. And Jose, I know you always keep tabs on the older horse division. Obviously, you got yeah. uh, world champion still in your barn, fired last time out, really nice race. Yeah. But I also know that you keep tabs on a lot of the other contenders, and, and, and especially going towards the end of the year, this big yeah. race, the champion of champions. Tell me how the, the world champion is doing and what's his next start and how you kind of see this older horse division kind of playing out. He, he's doing real well, you know. He, that's far he's doing real well. Obviously, last time he really showed a lot better, you know, than he did in the first race. Um, we had a little accident with Little Eye. He got cut uh, a few weeks ago, so but that's all um, healing up pretty good. Dr. Ashley Troncati really did a good job on it and putting it back together. Um, and um, but it's always a little something with Dash here and there, you know. So we have to be uh, always um, on top of it, you know, that he, everything's good with him. But um, hopefully he'll he'll fire the same way that he did in the Go Man Go, and um, it'll be an interesting race, you know. I know it's going to be tougher this year, you know. We got Jesse's first down, maybe coming down. We have um, Bodacious Eagle here already, so it's it's going to be a different kind of race, you know. And it's going to be an interesting race to see what happens. Introducing the Stallion roster at Burns Ranch in Menifee, California. Multiple AQHA racing champion sire, Walk Through Fire. One of the leading sires of money earners in 2016, Favorite Cartel. The champion and millionaire and multiple grade one producing sire, Foose. The stakes winning son of Walk Through Fire, Fly Through the Fire. The grade three stakes winning son of Separatist, Separate Interest. The champion sire and multiple grade one producing sire, Stel Corona. The Grade 1 Riadosa Derby winning BF Farm Boss and the multiple stakes winning Jess Being Valiant, all standing in Menifee, California at Burns Ranch.